Freedom is one of the most valuable commodities in the world today. It's important to take time to recognize those who fought for our freedom. For a select few players in the Sharks organization, this day was their chance to learn about life aboard a military ship, the USS Hornet. Players and staff start their day with a brief tour of the hangar deck and museum. We're on the hangar deck. Okay, so that's where you kind of store all the planes and stuff? We worked on our planes down here. This was kind of like a big garage. Okay. Actually, in the early days when the ship was first built, we stored our planes on the flight deck when they weren't okay. being operated. And then we'd bring them down here, we'd work on them, get them fixed, Fix put them back on the elevator. We are a museum that's open 362 days a year. The ship has a historical linkage not just to World War II and Korea to Vietnam, but also to the space program. And uh, we have programs to teach the future generations about the history, the sacrifice, and the commitment that the sailors who served on the Hornet made to this nation. This has a nine-cylinder piston engine in the nose, which was used extensively in Vietnam. This little boy over here is called a sea sprite. Yeah, this is pretty cool. I mean, just being on this uh, ship and just getting a quick tour. It's uh, pretty incredible to see. I mean, this is awesome. You get the, the museum. You get to see, you know, some of the, the cool stuff downstairs, uh, some of the planes and stuff. And, uh, and we got uh, the big inflatable rink, too. Play some street hockey with some kids. They're going pretty hard right now. So uh, yeah, it's, uh, it's a really cool experience. After their tour, the crew heads up to the deck where the Sharks Foundation has set up a floor hockey rink. So planning for this event started about two months ago in which we contacted the USS Hornet and asked if we could bring the Sharks Inflatable and some players out to bring hockey uh, to the East Bay and to an aircraft carrier. It's a great way to uh, get our message out to the community, work with the, the community foundation of the Sharks who also donated $5,000 to the Hornet Museum which we use for future education programs and uh, just a, a great way on a beautiful day with a beautiful view of San Francisco Bay. Expanding the sport of hockey in Northern California has always been a priority for the San Jose Sharks and this event is just another example of their dedication to that. It's nice to get out here you know uh, take a little quick break and uh, yeah come have some fun with, with some kids uh, put some smile on, on their face and they're putting some smiles on our face so uh, it's a, it's a great uh, mix up here, and uh, yeah, we've been, we've been enjoying it uh, a lot so far. You gotta be ready! <laughs> Icing again. It's, it's great, you know, you get a little bit of a, a mental break from it, and uh, yeah, it's just cool to come out and, and check this out. It's a really cool place, and uh, yeah, we're having a good time. Oh, heads up. Two one. <laughs> get it. Get out of here. It's a long way down. So as part of the Sharks Foundation's focus on Heroes Appreciation Month throughout the month of January, we've invited military members and their families to join us here for this experience today. So we've seen people from all over the Bay Area. Um, we've also been able to engage people that were just here visiting the museum for the day. A number of them were really surprised to come up to the flight deck and have Sharks and Barracuda players here. And so it's been a great experience seeing all of that come together. You still got it. Still got it, never lost. Never lost it. Oh! Bad deal. <laughs> you know, like I said, there's a, there's a lot of kids that came out today, uh, some parents too, and, and the people that, that, that work here. Uh, so it's incredible uh, to see that. Uh, like I said, it brings a lot of smiles, and, and that's what it's all about. Uh, gives us a lot of energy, and uh, yeah, we, we enjoy those uh, little things.